night. Accused of sexually harassing young women who applied for jobs at his dealerships. And today, the Washington Attorney General filed an injunction against 79-year-old Monty Massengale, alleging he discriminated against employees on the basis of their sex to include unwanted sexual advances. Okay, so I force Jeff Humphrey joins us now live at Green Acres Motors in Area Heights with a look at this alleged form of car lot couch casting. Jeff? Nadine Massingale was the owner of a trio of Green Acres car lots, including this one, until 2014. An attorney company for the company says Massingale is no longer actively involved in car sales, and the phone number that these alleged victims called in the hopes of landing a job was actually Massingale's personal cell. The attorney general claims the help wanted ads on Backpage.com targeted young women looking for their first job. The advertisements claimed no experience was necessary for the secretarial position. Just basic uh, sexual harassment where people are applying for the, a job and they go apply for the job and at that time um, there's been variations of what has occurred but uh, it's along the lines of sexual harassment. In 2012, sheriff's detectives arrested Massingale on a sexually motivated assault that happened at his Spokane Valley lot. The sheriff's office is now investigating Massingale for a recent incident involving a minor who secretly recorded alleged sexual come-ons with her cell phone. Investigators think there may be additional victims out there. If there are other people out there who uh, would like to let us know that, we'd like them to call Crime Check at uh, 456 2233 and uh, make a report. In the meantime, the Attorney General's office wants a judge to order Green Acres Auto to stop its discriminatory practices, including refusing to hire men for its secretarial positions. Nadine, the Attorney General's office also alleges that Massingale has been luring in young women in the hopes of having relations with them since 2012. Now the Attorney General wants to fine Evergreen Auto $2,000 for every time the discrimination or sexual harassment at the workplace happened. Reporting live in Airway Heights, Jeff Humphrey, KXLY4. Thank you, Jeff.